Playing the Monopoly game seems to be entertaining and educative, but the Accra edition promises to be interesting. The Monopoly Accra edition was launched at the Kempinski Hotel in Accra. Lovers of the game get to know the various landmarks in the capital city as they have fun playing the game. Monopoly Accra is an innovation and captures the mind while enjoying the game. Its launch in Accra started off with music and poetry with musician Adoma and spoken word artist Oswald Okaite. addition to having fun while playing the game, it also seeks to increase financial literacy, entrepreneurship, good behavior in players, and most of all, allow players to know the landmarks in Accra. The Deputy Minister for Tourism, Culture and Creative Arts, Abla Jifa Gumashi, commended the innovation and says it helps promote Ghana's tourism and culture. We now have the Accra Monopoly, which has our forts and castles our festivals and many other aspects of our culture and sites documented in the booklet that comes with the game. In the Accra Monopoly, you will find us, Ghanaians, and what we identify with. In the Accra Monopoly, it is about our capital city, and it should make us all very, very proud. This is a gift everyone will appreciate. I urge you to support one local business through your choices that you make on a daily basis. Gloria Ofori is the brain behind the Accra edition. We are looking at students, as we said, that's very, very close to our hearts because we want to put these games in schools so that we can use it as a platform to teach financial literacy. We are looking at tourists. We are looking at, I mean, the general public. We are looking at people who don't even know Ghana or haven't been here, when they get this game, it's practically like they're in Ghana. Some boxes of the game were donated to a number of schools, organizations and individuals. 